Hello and welcome back to Breath Edge. Now, a few things to just clarify um, is the reason why there hasn't been anything for like a week or something like that now is because I got some oh dire news at some point which meant that I needed to scramble and actually fix a few things in my private life so I didn't really have time now that's fixed now that's over so with me having that done and my <laughs> getting my lazy ass off the ground and get, actually get to work and not procrastinate we are now back and we will see where we need to go and do things um exactly how much i have left of the game i'm not sure but we will solder on and see where we go from here well all that i ask of you now is that you will like the video and maybe even subscribe that would be super awesome and nice if you did and if you're newly subscribed which i have had a few during this week where i haven't done much uh, thank you for joining us and uh, if you're new and such well welcome let's get going yeah i did open this up and if you don't know what this is or what happened here well go back and watch the end of the previous episode and you will understand how we are here and well what happened with this rocket anyway um let's see that's let's head out here we need to be careful we don't know how many of these coffin bots are left here True. Um, I don't know exactly which way the I. The door hasn't been used in twenty years. I don't think we can open it. I don't really know which way I should be going. Um, get some more water. Refined metal is actually pretty expensive, so Let's take some of that. Preservation capsules. They seem to contain the entire crew of this station. Or a second one was wasn't really ready for that. Uh, and this one seems to be the capsule for you. How terrible! They preserve corpses right in their spacesuits. I wouldn't want to be stuck here with your body for forty years. <laughs> the equipment is badly damaged. Even gravity has been disabled. At least the oxygen generators are working. By the way, how do you connect to them so quickly and imperceptibly on any debris? This is starting to raise questions. Yep.
I'm the bad guy from the beginning. <laughs> what in the world is this? Hmm. Something was being assembled here, or someone was being disassembled. Yeah. Too much. Apparently, we did find Babe. <laughs> wow. We will find. It looks like this is the only way out of here. Okay. see Normandy. Oh. I don't recommend flying too far from the station. We still need to find the control center and we can't get into Normandy from outside. Oh. Right. The remains of the cooling gel from the spaceship are scattered all over the area. Luckily, Normandy didn't get hit by one of these. <laughs> yeah, that was some time ago since I did the spacewalk now, so... I I'm... Suspecting that... I actually don't have a lot left of this game. It and looks like some kind of technical corridor. I hope we can get to the control center from here. And when I'm done with, like, when I have completed this game, I need to find a new game to play. I'm not entirely sure what to do. I have... I still can't believe that the Breath Edge Agency is directly involved in all this. If the robot hasn't lied to us, we need to send the compromising evidence before the massive attack begins. Otherwise, there will simply be nowhere to go back. I think there should still be some transmitting systems near the core, and for the sake of saving the galaxy, I would strongly recommend using them before we attempt to activate the warp jump. Yeah, so... <clears throat> I have my... Uh have some ideas of what to play uh, next but yeah I'm not sure we will see if you have any suggestions well just leave a comment and I will read it take it into consideration I have some ideas of what to play as I said Nothing is decided yet. I know I was looking at a raft. <clears throat> and something else which I can't remember right now, but... This place seems familiar. Isn't it where the coffin bots interrogated you? It is. Yes.
Looks like we found one of the station's control centers. We could have figured out it was here. Seems like the main systems are still working, unlike this coffin. Too bad. The coffin was connected to the control center, and it burned out along with all the connectors on the panel. I can't connect directly to it, but with your help, I can try to do it through the robot itself. Uh, of course. <clears throat> Just try to saw it as quietly as you can. They're probably looking for us. All right, now switch that little receiver over there. Done. I've connected to... No, 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 no. Oh, it's rusty. Ugh, disgusting. All right. I, uh... Well, I'm ashamed to admit, but the robot no longer has a direct connection to the station. But it still has an unencrypted cache block where I saw the most disgusting moments of this coffin bot's life. I also found the passwords for the doors and magnetic airlocks, but still, the absolute quantity of that abhorrent data was overpowering. We can go back to Normandy. Okay. Good news. Yes. Which way? It looks like the guards died without our help. Lucky us. Yeah, lucky us. Think Just it? be as quiet as possible. This way? Something's wrong. I think they're waiting for us behind the next door. It's too quiet. Be extra cautious. Look nothing. Look at nothing happening. Ready your weapon. It's about to get hot. Stress. It looks like they're too smart. I think they've set up an ambush right outside Normandy. Well, there is no ambush at all. Shooting starts. That's it. This is the end. They're on the captain's bridge. I don't know what to do. We're trapped. Uh, where's the ambush? Did I turn on the suspenseful music for nothing? Ah, never mind. It's time for us to leave. I suspected as much. Clearance for departure received. There's only one step left. The coffin bots wanted to connect the core directly to the ship with the mother station, and we need to do something similar with Normandy. It will require a huge amount of energy to travel on the pleasure shuttle to the habitable sectors, and, as I've already mentioned, the core can give us that. If we're faster than the core exploding, of course. Of course. And yes, since there is no babe, we must... What?
It can't be. We saw the robots die. We won't fall for this a second time because... Hey, easy there. You'll make me... <laughs> of course we fall for it. Of course. Could you be more careful? We almost crashed. You won't fall for the same bait again, will you? We need to send the compromising evidence all over the galaxy and connect to the core without blowing ourselves up. We don't have time for non-existent survivors. Uh, let's see. Oh, we're in chapter six now. Which I don't know if it's the last one. I think it is. Captain Shepard's autopilot is still active. I hope it will simply turn off when the systems reboot. Otherwise, I won't be able to change the route for the warp acceleration. Oh, this is it. The core. Let's forget about Babe for a second. We need to look around. Right, and one of these robots is sending us messages. By the way, she doesn't have that awful accent anymore. <sighs> Be careful, all the data on the core is classified, and I have no idea where we're going. Yeah. I feel like we're in the middle of a conversation. Maybe each of the survivors, including Captain Shepard, had their own dead babe. Yeah, I thought I saw something. Up that jiggling around bit, but uh, yeah, they will chip away on the they feed. The first time we see the ship like this, it looks like the coffins are going to use it to connect the core to the mother station, or they are still going to do it, judging by their activity. I've never realized how impressive artificial intelligence must be to control an entire galaxy. Finally, all of them. I hope so. Yeah, they will chip through the, the ship HP. So you can dock to this spaceship. Need to get rid of them. The airlock is asking for access codes, and it's using foul language. This is the first time I've seen an airlock with an artificial intelligence, but it's clearly not happy with us. Well, we will dock anyway. Ooh, we made it very angry by docking without clearance. You should have heard all those expressions. The airlock hates us to the core. Start the connection. Plan B. I like charades. <laughs> All right. Let's see what we need to do here. What an interesting place. Start the connection, she said. I have a crazy idea, but first let's take a look around. Right, this spaceship is definitely connected directly to the core. I can't help thinking that we can use this if we put together a stabilizing unit. Right. Um... A charging 
station for old battery power types of spaceships. If we can build a voltage transmission unit based on this station, we can power Normandy without melting its plating. Yeah, that would be nice. That would be nice. An ideal place for a diverting unit. Probably. Try switching that red lever over there. Yes, everything is perfect. We can connect Normandy to the core via this spaceship and activate the warp jump if we find the control post. Then we will only have to... Wait, don't you think the camera's behavior is strange? It looks like it's focusing on the airlock on purpose as if a mob of aggressive robots is about to... <laughs> oh. Hi. Did I do this? Did I learn to see the future and shoot lightning? I had no doubt that I was a genius. Why does she keep interrupting me? Although this time I'm even grateful to her. Perhaps this coffin has become so used to playing the role of a woman that it really decided to help us. Let's connect Normandy quickly and get out of here. Or it's the real babe. This time it's the real one. <laughs> All oh, right, I need to make those. I need to create the stabilizing unit, voltage transmission, and the diverting unit. Um. Okay. Plastic, something I needed for them. Stabilizing unit. Uh, let's see, voltage transmission unit, magnet, alkali, electronics, and then resin. I think that was all of it. I might have missed a thing. Nope. Nope. I got all of it. Thank God my memory actually worked in my favor this time. And I need... Uh, okay. I need to make a compensator. And a generator. So alkali and titanium. Start with that one. Compensator. And then I need a generator which require alkali and electronics. Thankfully I have made sure to have all the resources. And I need a leucoplasma. There we go. And that should be all of it. And here we go. Let's see if we can free up my inventory a bit. Like that make sure we eat and drink splendid this unit won't last long but we don't need it to one electrical impulse to the core of normandy will be enough 
Yep. And... Good. With this unit, we'll have a chance of not being fried along with Normandy. Good. And then the last one. Perfect. If I've calculated correctly, this unit will be able to divert the excess power away from Normandy. Everything is ready. Oh. I get the feeling this message is incomplete. I still don't trust her, of course, but we probably don't have much choice. Where's this airlock 5A she mentioned? I don't know. I... The airlock has fallen silent. It's so quiet. Can you hear it? No, you couldn't have heard it. You can't even imagine how nice it is when crazy artificial intelligence stops constantly mumbling at you. Is it this way? I hope we destroyed all the coffins when we came here. I wouldn't fly there without Normandy. Yeah, but I need to fly this way. Without Normandy. Yeah, I think this is the correct way to go. There was a serious battle here. No wonder. The core was supposed to be guarded by the best forces on the liner. where it takes us. This way, apparently. Apparently, yeah. Uh, let's open the door. No one's here to meet us. Neither in a peak spacesuit, nor in any other one. Uh, yeah. That is true. It looks like a technical exit for servicing the liner's plating. case I get damaged let's be careful this time I don't want to get hit on the helmet with stick again what a strange place to meet can we go back no 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 back is the other way <laughs> seems clear I don't like this at all me neither. These seem to be the personnel cabins, not the control center. That's strange. The personnel were obviously killed a long time ago. Who was shooting who then? Good question. And that is, I think, a question we need to answer in the next episode. So, well, as I said uh, in the beginning, like and subscribe, that would be awesome if you did. And 
we will continue exploring and see if we can reach the conclusive end um, at some point exactly how much I have left as I said I don't know I might have a fair bit left or I might actually be way closer than I think I don't know so on screen you should be able to see the quick access uh, you should be able to see quick access to the playlist uh, you youtube recommendation and uh, quick access to the subscribe button so i think with that mess of an outro we will leave and come back next time so thanks for watching goodbye and i hope i'll see you in the next one